certified by WeatherAid for the most accurate forecast in the Ozarks. Well, looking at the drought monitor that released from today, technically Springfield isn't included in any kind of drought or dry conditions, but it's real bad up to the north. Looks like northern Morgan County, Miller County, up towards there, seeing uh, that's the extreme drought, the worst of the drought, kind of a bullseye in central Missouri. We have severe drought here in the orange, including Lake Ozark to Clinton, down to Warsaw in Benton County, and uh, it's dry, folks. They've been dry up there quite some time. Just They've seen rain, just not a huge amount and not widespread. It's been hit or miss showers for folks up there. Now, hopefully we're going to change that for this weekend as we've got a pretty widespread chance of rain coming to the Ozarks for then. More on that in just a minute. Right now, satellite radar seeing the rain showers now riding the cold front. Rain activity is moving from north to south with a gradual southwesterly direction, but generally north to south seeing rain now up here towards uh, Lebanon, Camden, Lake Ozark, down towards Warsaw. Clinton seeing some rain showers moving out of Warrensburg, Hermitage, Buffalo, Phillipsburg. All looking at some light to moderate rain showers, maybe a rumble of thunder mixed in there as well. Melbourne, Arkansas, Ash Flat, Salem, Mountain Home, looking at some rain showers moving your direction as well. And again, it's not widespread. It's kind of widely scattered is what we're going to call it. And we'll continue to see that activity move to the southwest as we go through the afternoon. Springfield right now is dry, still cloudy though. A little bit of a haze out there on the horizon. It's not bad though either. 72 degrees for, wind, for temperatures. Winds are from the southeast here in town, six miles an hour. Now there's a cold front again coming through the area. Cloudy in Branson now as well. And that cold front's about right here. We maybe see mostly easterly winds or northeast winds is where that front is. Getting close to Springfield. It's not here yet, but it will arrive soon enough. Behind the front, looking at temperatures now in the 60s, 68 in Camden still, 74 Rolla. And then where it hasn't quite made it and clouds haven't made it yet either, looking at mid to low 80s across here, 85 now in Joplin. So where do we go from here? Looks like midday, I think we'll make it up to the low 80s. Rain chance will be increasing for Springfield too in southwest Missouri going into the afternoon hours. 4 p.m. looks like a scattered chance, 30 to 40 percent chance there. Ongoing rain showers through this evening, wrapping up overnight tonight. We should be dry for your Friday. Here's how things play out on Futurecast. Again, scattered rain showers ongoing, slowly moving down to the south and west. Timing for Springfield looks like after 1 p.m., maybe 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Start to see that rain shower line move on in. A few thunderstorms out of this, non-severe, just a little bit of thunder and lightning. Ongoing through this evening, here's 9 p.m., wrapping up overnight tonight. Maybe a few lingering showers tomorrow morning in northern Arkansas. And we should be dry and becoming sunny for Friday afternoon. A good looking day for us there. Jumping to the weekend, we're going to be no stranger to the rain coming here for your Saturday night into your Sunday. Looks like Saturday should mostly be dry, holding off on rain until we get to the afternoon. Start to see a first wave move in. Then the storm system comes out of the northwest, gives us a cold front that'll give us more rain, a better chance for rain on your Sunday. Wrapping up Sunday night will be dry going into your Monday. So several rounds of rain coming away, scattered today, dry tomorrow for your Friday. And then 80s on Saturday, again Saturday morning, midday should be all right. Saturday afternoon looks to be rain chance with better chance of rain on Sunday before drying out again on your Monday. All right, Tom, plenty of rain chances in that seven day forecast.